everyone so today we're gonna be building the swing arm and subframe and this is the first parts bag that we need gp101 or gp101 we also need the uh, gp108 spring and shaft set okay um first step c16 and then two and then this C14 and C15 they should be placed like this um, so it says here to glue this together so we'll be doing that <coughs> with this it says CA glue but this works great for me. Yes. They should be like that. Okay. Next, we need a GP103, the swing arm set. Three. Okay. So, and then this. 
snap it. Just put it inside. Like so. So the next step, we have A1 right here, and then this we did earlier, and we're going to put this stem into this hole right here, and also align it with this one here. Alright, so basically we just insert it, and make sure this one is aligned. And we just press it down like so. Okay, and then we put this 3 by 8 TP screw on the side. We're gonna work with the swing arm these two pieces right here and we will be sandwiching this between these two and we need this 3 by 11 shaft put it on here like so this thing here so and then this white pin 4 by 25 we put it here and then we close it make sure everything is aligned like that and then this long black rod we place it here like so put another screw 3 by 8 TP or SD screw uh, right here okay okay next step put this 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 we uh, put this three together gonna place this rod into this hole right here the one in the middle like so and then this piece we're gonna hold like this and these two holes should match these two right here and then this middle one screws um, again these are 3 by 8 TP right so we place one here and then another one here step is we're gonna use this D8 okay and we're gonna match this here and 
then we will put these two together. So, right next step, we need to put these three screws on, and that is still a uh, three by eight uh, ST or TP screw. This. you're done it's gonna look something like this all right and that's it we have completed steps one and two with the modifications needed I cut this one here cut this one here epoxied the frame here all right thank you so much for watching guys and uh, watch out for the next video i appreciate your support